the question is, is will a 4570 hollow point bullet expand in water? These bullets are my own hand loads. It's a 300 grain Hornaday bullet and they're going about 2300 feet per second. Some of them are a little bit faster, some of them are just a little bit under 2300, but that's uh, that's basically what we're looking at. We're gonna shoot it today through a Remington rolling block. This is actually a replica of a Remington rolling block. It's, um, the receiver was made by Navy Arms and the gun itself was made by Mullen Custom Guns in Plainville, Indiana. This is probably the only video on the internet about Mullins Custom Guns in Plainville, Indiana. I don't know how many guns he made, but I don't think it was very many. Anyway, I've got these five buckets of water set up behind me. Because, you know, sometimes you just don't know if buckets of water are going to attack you or not. So it's good to know what the ballistics are on your ammunition against buckets of water. People say that's not relevant, but I think differently. Hey, you want to see how a rolling block works? Let me show you real quick. This is a pretty cool action. So this is your actual hammer back here. And you pull back on... I don't even know what this is called. I just call it the second hammer, but it's not a second hammer. It's like your block lock or something like that. And there you, there's your extractor. And what you do, you slip your round right in there, up against the extractor. Then you close this one, and now it's ready to fire. And what happens when you pull that trigger this block falls underneath this block, which locks it in place. And that's what keeps this from coming back whenever the round is fired. But anyway, it's a pretty cool action. All right, let's shoot these things. I got a really good feeling that I'm going to get really wet. Oh boy, here we go. <laughs> oh man that was great <laughs> so I'm gonna guess I haven't looked yet but I'm gonna guess that it went into the second jug let's take a look yeah there it is That is gnarly. Wow. That was really pl pretty explosive, but you know, this is probably a little bit faster than your typical 4570 round is running. That's pretty cool. When I get back to the house, I'll weigh that and see, uh, see how much weight was retained. It feels pretty light, I can tell you that. Pretty cool.